vlog and all about Piggy's I'm Jen. This is Miss Thelma, and we're doing well this evening. Sue's not going to be in this episode. She's enjoying a warm bath this evening, although it's warm in my house right now. But whatever. So today we're doing another episode of Let's Rate That Treat. So we attempted to make um, a hard hay block. Is that that's kind of what I'd call it? A link the original video in the description for you. Why does your nose look so big on camera, baby? She says, why does your face look so big? <laughs> um, and it was the most epic fail. I was frustrated, if you couldn't tell in the video, when I made, like, a loud growling noise practically. Um, whatever. So we're still going to rate the treat. So... On the easiness of the recipe, to be honest, I would rate it a 1. My mom even said that. It was like, take pellets, put half a cup of water in, grind pellets, you know, and then it was grind, you know, put in a bowl, grind hay, and then put the hay in the bowl, and then 3 4 cup carrots, so, so you got to grind those or shred them. Doom. And then a half a cup of applesauce mix. And then it was like, you may need to add more water so that it can't, it can, you can hold it together. Which I did. I followed this recipe to like a T, okay? So, I followed it to a T. And then you put it in the oven at 250 for 15 minutes, okay? Good. Take out of the oven and you use a cookie cutter to, um... Cut it into chunks, but you don't separate it for, and then you put it back in the oven for 15 minutes. You separate the chunks. Well, I want to separate the chunks, and they absolutely just start crumbling all over into, like, this fine dust, I'd almost call it. Let me get my measuring cup out. So, yeah. And then it was, once you separate them, um, you're supposed to, um, bake them another 15 minutes and then flip them. And then bake them for 15 to 30 minutes. Just It was very, like, tedious. You know what I mean? I definitely wouldn't recommend it. Maybe it has the potential to be an awesome recipe. Personally, I thought it was an epic fail. Um, so, one for easiness of the rep recipe. I'm also going to add another star today. We're going to do a star from now on. A one to five star on how it smells when it's baking. You guys, I want it to vomit so bad. It just, it, it stunk. It stunk our house up. Our house literally smelled like a poop bomb went off in it. <sighs> it was horrible. And I don't mind the smell of like Timothy hay and pellets and, you know, but all of it combined and then you're baking it in the oven and, mm, no. So one star on the smell did not smell good. And I'm not complaining about, I've made multiple treats now. And of course, all of them kind of have a slight order, but odor. But this one had the worst odor. Fail, fail, fail. So one, a, one star on, uh-oh, Thelma and Diamond are not. A one star on, um, sorry baby girl, I wasn't petting him. On the smell, the next was, do they hold together? Obviously not one star. So they did not clump together at all. They would, they, I mean, literally, let me show you guys the bag. Look at that. They're like, there's like a couple chunks, and this isn't even very good lighting. Hold on. No diamond? Diamond, no. My colleague now wants to eat. Hold on. Look at this. It's like all crumbled. So frustrating. Okay. The next, I'm going to put this back to normal lighting because I don't want to blind any of my piggy. The next was, do my guinea pigs like them? Yeah, they really liked it, but it's all crumble. It's just crumbly crumbly mess so I would give that a five star on if my guinea pigs liked it um another thing is how many ingredients it took by the way I did not want to waste these after okay the recipe called for one cup pellets one cup hay I'm pretty sure it was three-fourths cup carrots a half a cup of water to three-fourths cup and then a half a cup of applesauce I did not want to waste these after I used all these pellets, all this hay, which it's a cup, a cup of hay is not that bad. Do not get me wrong. Sit, Diamond. Diamond, my 
Polly, which is the lastie, by the way, she's mud covered, but she loves my guinea pigs, and my guinea pigs love her, but she just wants to love them, and right now, someone's not in the mood. Um, I just, now I forgot my train of thought. Boop. Um, <laughs> I just, um, no, I'm gonna, I'll be right back. And now I remember what I was saying. I didn't want to waste these after I used all this hay, all this pellets, which one cup hay, like I said, wasn't that much. Carrots, this applesauce. You guys, I literally special, I literally ordered in like these three massive containers of applesauce from a Sam's Club because I honestly thought this vid recipe was going to be a success. And I'm just disappointed. I feel like every hard treat so far has been an epic fail. Sorry. I'm having dog issues here. So, overall, I would have to rate these a one star. I'm sorry, recipe. but And by the way, I want to clarify, this recipe I did not find on YouTube. This recipe was found on, like, a odd site. So, if you guys want to have me test a recipe and rate your recipe, let me know in the comment box. I'd be happy to do it. Um, no hard feelings to anybody that did this. I remember you guys, I'm not an expert baker, but I honestly followed this recipe to like a T. I was very, very disappointed. I think at the end of the video you could tell I was disappointed when I kind of made this loud growling noise. Um, yeah, I just, I was heartbroken. Also another thing, it could have been because I didn't have parchment paper, but I don't think parchment paper had to do anything with this. I was using a non-stick baking pan. I, you know, like I said, I followed every instruction, so, um, yeah, I'm going to end this video here, thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, bye for now.